Another short question is that you can spread water over a greater distance by placing your thumb over the end of the garden hose. Then by leaving it completely uncovered, explain how this works. We know that the cross sectional area, the cross sectional area decreases by placing thumb at the end of a garden hose as a result water coming out with a greater speed and cover more distance because according to equation of continuity av is equal to constant so we can write v is inversely proportional to area hence area of os decrease then speed of water increase why does smoke rise faster in a chimney on a windy day first we know about the bernoulli principle according to bernoulli principle pressure decrease if the velocity increase and vice versa on a windy day when below wind blow with high speed at the top of a chimney which decrease the pressure as this decrease the pressure i drop chimney decrease the pressure as the pressure is increase at the bottom of the chimney due to wind at low speed <coughs> this pressure difference at the top and bottom of the chimney push the smoke upward from high pressure to low pressure Question is two boats moving in parallel path close to one another is colliding by when the ships are moving close to each other then the area between them decrease area decrease then water speed increase resulting pressure between two 
शेप्स डिक्रीज बट द प्रेशर ऑन द आउटर साइड ऑफ द शेप इंक्रीज ड्यू टू लो वाटर स्पीड द फोर्स एक्ट ऑन द बोर्ड्स फ्रॉम हाई प्रेशर टूवर्ड द लो प्रेशर विच पुल द बोर्ड्स टूवर्ड ईच अदर एंड दे कैन कोलाइट Here we discuss the short question that is the cricket ball move past an observer from left to right. Here is the cricket ball past an observer from left to right. Spinning counter clockwise direction is anti. Here it is the ball that is moving in the ball that is moving in anti clockwise direction. In which direction will the ball tend to deflect? In deflective force, where is the end? Here is the motion of the ball in this direction and the speed in this direction. So this is the low speed and high pressure in this direction. The spin and the wind speed at the same direction. So high speed and low pressure of the ball. So this high pressure and low pressure move they deflect the ball from high pressure to Low pressure deflecting forces act away from the observer. So here we write direction of air is opposite to the direction of the spin ball toward the observer toward the Head toward the observer direction of air is opposite to the direction of the spin ball. Therefore, speed of air decreases and pressure increases. If we discuss, <coughs> this is toward the observer, away from the observer, away from the observer. Direction of air is along to the direction of the spin ball. Therefore, speed of air increases and pressure decreases. therefore the ball deflect away from the observer from high pressure to low pressure